क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टीन एक्सरसाइज टू एफ सिक्स अडल्ट एंड फोर सीनियर सिटीजन हैव टू पे डॉलर टू हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी एट वाइल थर्टीन अडल्ट एंड सेवन सीनियर सिटीजन हैव टू पे डॉलर फोर फिफ्टी नाइन टू विजिट एन एक्सीबिशन एट द आर्ट साइंस म्यूजियम फाइंड द टोटल अमाउंट टू अडल्ट एंड अ सीनियर सिटीजन हैव टू पे टू विजिट द एक्सीबिशन नाउ फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल साइन अ वेरिएबल नो लेट the amount one adult will have to pay one adult will pay b x and the amount one senior citizen will pay b y okay now according to the given conditions Six adults and four citi senior citizens have to pay two twenty-two, uh, two twenty-eight dollars. So I'm going to write it down. One adult will pay X. So six adults will pay six X. One senior citizen will pay Y. So four senior citizens will pay four Y. Is equals to Two twenty-eight. Now another part. Thirteen adults and seven senior citizens will pay four fifty-nine dollars. So I'm going to write it down. Thirteen x plus seven y is equals to four fifty-nine. So these are two simultaneous equations. A and B. Okay. So in order to get same coefficient, I am going to first of all I have selected y variable and I am going to eliminate y variable. So in order to get get the same coefficient in both of the equation with y variable i will multiply equation a with 7 and i will multiply equation b with 4 why i have done this i have discussed this in very detail in the last exercise so if you don't understand this step you need to review my previous exercise exercise 2f 2e sorry so let's do it a implies that 42 x Seven x seven multiplied by six x is forty two x plus twenty eight y is equals to two twenty eight multiplied by seven is one five nine six. Equation B implies four multiplied by thirteen is fifty two x plus twenty eight y is equals to one eight three six. And to eliminate Y, I am going to subtract. Okay, ten x two forty in minus ten x and minus two forty and minus and minus will go cancel zero and zero. So the value of x is twenty four. Now I am going to put this value of X in my equation A. So A implies that six multiplied by twenty-four. This equation twenty-four plus four y is equals to two twenty-eight, which means six multiplied by twenty-four is one forty-four plus four y is equals to two twenty-eight. This will go on the other side. Four y is equals to Eighty-four. The value of y is twenty-one. Okay. Now let's get back to our question once more. 
So we have got the value of the amount that one adult will pay. The amount that one adult will pay is 24 and the amount that one senior citizen will pay is $21. But this is not enough. The main requirement of our question is find the total amount two adults and one senior citizen will pay. So we have to actually find out the total amount means the total amount one adult will pay plus one senior citizen will pay. So this is the basic requirement. Okay, now we have already calculated the value of x and the value of y. We will just simply put these the value of these variable into our required equation and we will get the value. So 2x plus y means 2 multiplied by 24 plus 21. And 2 multiplied by 24 is 48 plus 21, which means $69. So, two adults and one senior citizen will pay $69. Okay, now question number 15 from exercise 2F. There are some chickens and goats on a farm. Given that the animal have total of 50 heads, and 40 legs how many more chickens than goats are there so there is a farm in which chickens and goats are present and according to the question given that animals have a total of 50 heads that means all chickens and goat including chicken and goats their total heads is 50 so, so first of all let's assign variable let chicken be x and goat be y now total number of heads we all know that all animals have one head so the total number of heads means sum of the chicken and the goat will make the total number of hats so x plus y is equals to 50 and 140 legs now we all know that chicken has how many legs each chicken has how many legs two legs so it's going to be 2x and the goat has how many legs 4 legs so one goat means it has 4 legs now it says that total of their leg is 140 so we know that 2x plus 4y is equals to 140 so these are two equations that we have got and let's solve them simultaneously now i have decided to eliminate x variable how can i eliminate x variable by multiplying equation a with 2 to get the same coefficient so multiply multiply a with 2 we will get equation a implies that 2 x plus 2 y is equals to 100 now copying equation b as it is 2x plus 4y is equals to 140 subtracting equation a equation b from equation a to get to get rid of x variable minus 2y is equals to 100 minus 140 is 40 and to 
minus 40. 2 1 2, 2 20s are, 20s are 40 and y is equals to 20, sorry. Okay, now put a, put y in equation a. It's going to be x plus 20 is equals to 50 and x is equals to 20 will go on the other side with minus and with 50 minus 20 is 30. So the value of x is 30 and the value of y is 20. So now we know that our chicken is chickens were 30 or 30 and goats are 20 okay but this is not the answer the required answer let's get back to the questions how many how many more chickens than goats are there so we know that our chicken chickens are 30 and goats are 20 so how many more chickens are there 10 more chickens are there thank you for watching